good morning y'all and welcome to the channel it is currently 10 a.m and i am on my way to go and fill out an application at a hotel and after i do that i'm gonna do a few orders i actually already have a few orders on my roster that i have to complete and after that i'll just be getting ready to because tonight is my first night over at the new building for my um job so my um idea is to have my main job and then have a wholesale job because i want a hotel job for the benefits and also i want to be able to buy a trailer when my lease is over here i want to buy a trailer and also buy land um i'm not sure how far i can get with that but i do want to be putting money to the side just um just in case I find something in that price range. I don't really know how much I need to save. I'm just gonna be saving like my entire check from the second job um, for moving. So I know I want to buy out a trailer. I wanna buy one, like a cash trailer, like under $5,000. And then I wanna buy land to put on, to put the trailer on the land. My thing is, is like, if I don't uh, find land right away, I know I can buy a trailer around here. The one I was telling you about is $2,200 and I can buy that and just have it in the mobile home park until I save up enough money to buy my land. But I'm not sure if I wanna go about it that way. So I'm trying to just work myself as much as possible so that I can have money for my land and to buy my trailer by November. So, that's an obstacle of mine that I'm trying to get through and complete because I just feel like with me having my land, right? Me having my trailer, which is paid off, I won't have to pay lot fees or anything because it'll be my land. I'll be able to save up enough money to get a down payment on a home um, shortly. And I'll be able to pay the things that I need to pay and just do everything that I need to do. So that is my thought process. If you guys have any um, tips on like how to find land, how to find nice trailers, please leave comments down below because I've been looking um, on Facebook Marketplace and Craigslist and I've come across a few, but all of the ones that I've uh, seen, they're like so far away. And so I just need to find something that's out here. There's nothing wrong with getting one in a mobile um, home park and just moving it. But I want to make sure that, you know, everything is together and there aren't any issues when it comes down to moving it. I actually even thought about, like, building one, like, a brand new mobile home. But I don't think that's, like, in my budget for right now. I'm going to just be more realistic. And just buy a cash trailer, put it on some land, and then do it that way so I can save money for my dream home. I'm only, well, I just turned 20 last week. So I'll have enough time before I start trying to have kids and stuff like that to save up money um, and live in my trailer. So that is what we're doing today. I'm getting ready to go get the ball started on that. I'm just trying to get another job so I can have more income going into my savings because right now my money is going solely towards bills and I need another stream of income going solely towards um just moving. I really want to have this done before it's time to move. I do not want to have to extend my lease here. And if I do, I want it to only be for like an extra month or so. Like, I do not want to be here. So, that is my plan. And yes, I will see y'all once I leave the hotel. And I'll tell y'all about everything and if I liked it and everything. So, I'll see y'all when I come back. Okay, y'all. So, actually, where I am. Well, where this hotel is located, there's like a hotel everywhere. So there's one right here. Now turn, there's one right here. Turn, there's one right here. Turn, there's one right here. And there's hotels across the street. So I think I'm gonna just be hotel hopping at this point. I'm about to go around to all of them and see if they're hiring. Because I really want another job. I really want to do what I have to do to get into my mobile home. And it is what it is. I am still doing um, stuff for the business wise, but um, I feel like it'll be better if I had a set income coming in, I guess you could say, to actually know that it's coming because business is, like, not guaranteed. 
So, yeah, I will see y'all when I come from up out of here. Okay, y'all, so I just left the first hotel, and it turns out I actually did do an interview here before. So, they have my information on file, and she said to just call them um, at 3 o'clock. That's when the manager will be back, and I can just get an updated update on it then but i'm about to go to this hotel across the street and then the hotel over next door just to see what they say okay so i went to three out of the four hotels and i put in an application at one of them um another one she told me to call back and check at three o'clock and then the last one, I didn't even have to put an application in because they don't have the hours that I need that I work with my other job. So, as of right now, I'm still looking. Y'all, cross your fingers to me because I'm really trying to get this done. I'm really trying to move and do what I have to do. So, just cross your fingers that I get the job over there. Um, and, yeah, I will see y'all somewhere along the way because today I have a lot of stuff to do before I go to work. I want to go... We do a few orders. When it's about to start raining, we do a few orders and just be outside the house and do what I have to do because I'm about to start working tonight. I'm so nervous to start working. I've never worked overnight. I've um, went in like early in the morning, but I've never worked overnight. So hopefully it isn't too bad, y'all. I will see y'all when I get back to the house or either when I get to my first destination. I see this um, store Habitat for Humanity and I want to go in there and see what they have because I see a lot of people like redoing the pieces that they get from there. So I just want to see what they have over there. I may or may not stop, but I know that I'm going to leave up out of here because it's, it's going to start storming y'all. It's like the trees blowing, the sky is dark. And today's supposed to be a good day. That means I'm going to be driving all in the rain all day. Because I got to get orders done, y'all. I got to make this money. I will see y'all when I get back to the house.